Hello. Okay. Um, I've realised that I've passed 300 subscribers. Um, gaining subscribers was not really my intention. It wasn't really my... I uh, started out to do. I've just done this lock picking channel for fun. Um, but seeing as I've passed 300, I did want to say thank you to all those that subscribed. And I want to do a bit of a giveaway. So if you're interested in uh, having a freebie then I'm just gonna for a bit of fun I'm gonna do a giveaway so first of all let me show you what I'm gonna offer in the giveaway now recently I've been picking dimple uh, dimple locks and I've been doing sorry, foil impressioning so I thought I'd chuck one of those uh, a small foil impressioning kit in there and you normally get about eight or ten of these uh, foil foils in this kit but I've chucked in some more in there to fill out the box to give you more things to practice with. I've also purchased another one of these uh, dimple foil boxes that contains this area. It's around about 100 and I've chucked a few extra ones in there as well just to give you plenty plenty foils to, uh, to have a go with. Um, but that's no good if you don't have a, a dimple lock to pick. So here is a Latham's uh, dimple lock, six pin. It's got two scooter pins and it's a great one to practice foil impressioning with. What I also want to give with this is a bag of pins. This is from um, South Coast Lock Bits and in here is some um, uh, security pins, standard pins, so you can actually pin this up less secure, more secure and test out your skill in foil impressioning and practice and you know so on and so forth uh, so that's part of the giveaway but i want to chuck into that and just add a little bit extra so i want to chuck in some uh, padlock shims just a bit of an extra and also one of those cameras like you've seen me use on one of my videos i can't remember exactly which video it is but i'll Put it here somewhere on the screen which video it is uh, that i've used one of these um so i'm going to chuck the camera in the shims the spur security pins padlock foils foil impressioning kit and actually it's just a simple um giveaway just to say thank you and just just for a bit of fun so what I'm hoping that um, you're going to be able to do to win this is, okay, what I want you to do is to make a video and I want you to do impressions of five different lock pickers. Now you don't have to do an imitation or, you know, fireworks, whatever. You don't have to be an imitation, um, do not have to be an exact imitation you can just do like catchphrases to see if people can work out with the catchphrases. I'm celebrating my 300 out there, can you hear that? It's not even bonfire night. Um, so that's the idea. Five impersonations, impressions, if you want to do that, or you can just do um, like the catchphrase that, that kind of lot pickers team seem to have. Five of your favourite ones or five that you think you, you can remember or you want to do. Uh, for example, you know, you've got a lot picking lawyer who says, um, this is a lot picking lawyer. What I've got for you today is, oh, that's all I, you know, I'm, that's all I got for you today, blah, blah, blah. Bosnian Bill, you know, quit flapping your lips, Bill. That, you know, a couple of the, the catchphrases that they tend to use and pick five of them. Also, I want you to include either in Postscript on your video somewhere, uh, the name of the person who you're impersonating, impressioning, or whichever way you choose to do it. That would be good if you could add it uh, maybe straight after you've done the video would be better. So everyone can have a bit of a guess as you're doing it. You say, oh, that's such a body, oh, that's such a body. You can do five famous ones, the ones that's well known or some that's not so well known because it also helps us to introduce us to who the people are so it's almost like a shout out video as well uh you can uh so i said you can do it in postscript or you can 
you know, you can write the name down on a piece of paper and then as you uh, as you've done that impersonation, you can put the piece of paper down here. And if you do it after, just after, at least it gives us time to guess who you think it might be. Uh, there's no prize for guessing, it's just a bit of fun. Uh, the, the prize is for the video. Uh, you need to also do um, on the screen on a piece of paper, it will be a hashtag. So you do hashtag Roy 300 and I'll put that up here now so you can see it. Um, that needs to be included on your video and you have to you have to be a subscriber and I'm not doing this for more subscribers I'm just doing this as a bit of a thank you and a fun giveaway you have to be a subscriber you have to display your entry on your channel and email me the link of the video um, and I'll put my email below you have until Monday, sorry, you have until midnight, the 20th of December, 2020. And that's on the UK uh, time zone, 20th of December by midnight. After that, I won't be able to include any, any latecomers that go after that. I won't actually include that. I may uh, mention it, but it won't be included in my list for the, um, for the draw. So you have, um, till the 20th of December to get your entry in and I will pick a winner somewhere between the 25th and the 1st of January 2021 uh, and my decision will be final and in the event that I make a mistake I've missed somebody off for that I really 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 will apologize in advance although I hopefully I won't make any mistakes um, and my de decision will have to be final so that's the entry I'll stick all the information below and I just hope that you just, you know, let's all entertain ourselves. Let's have a good laugh and, you know, let's just, let's just enjoy ourselves. Okay. And, and I'm going to send this, whoever wins it, whatever you are in the world, I will, uh, providing it's legal to pick locks in your country, I'm happy to send it to you and, um, and I think that's it. So with that said, a great big thank you to everybody for subscribing and watching my videos and commenting. And I just want to say a big, big thank you. And let's just enjoy ourselves. So with that said, take care. You have a nice day and um, go make some videos. Bye bye now. Bye bye. Hello again. Here's an old lever lock that I've got, and look at that, works nice and smooth. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a video, and I'm going to show you how to pick this. But I'm going to make what I'm going to first need to do is make a. Um, I need to make a pick from an old Euro cylinder. So until next time, tarar a bit. All right, guys. I've been on eBay, and I've got this lock from my favourite Ukrainian lock seller. Dang it, it's only small. You sold me a duff lock. Anyway, let's get to picking it. So we're gonna see how we get this open. Anyway, we don't need no stinking keys. So let's pick this lock. Anyway, this week's giveaway. So stick around and I'll tell you how to win it. Stay safe. Stay legal. What I have for you today is a combination lock that's been around for a long time and so is the floor with it. So we're going to use this feeler gauge and we're going to use a, a method, an old age old method to pick this lock and bypass it. So that's all I have for you today. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And if you like this video, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Hi there, it's Chris here, and welcome to another Stock Lock Sunday. <laughs> oh, hi Suki. Hi Suki. 
I see you've come to say hello. <laughs> well done, old girl. There you go. Come. Go and play, Suki. That's my Stock Lock Sunday. Leave a question, ask a comment, and thank you to all my subscribers. <laughs> and I'll see you next time. <laughs> hey guys, I just want to show you what I dug up using my metal detector. You know, a bit rusty, a bit, bit old, but we're going to see if we can get these locks open. So, remember, it's soon going to be Christmas. So I'm looking for locks to go into my Christmas series. And that's all I've got for you guys. So remember, skill always beats luck. And have a nice day.